Let's take a look at the scope and sequence. A scope and sequence is a detailed plan for each lesson in the curriculum. Ta-da! The scope and sequence. For this video, we will be looking at Algebra 1, Unit 1, Lesson 1. But rest assured, all scope and sequences follow the same format for each of the courses in the a College Ready curriculum. Each time a new unit starts, at the top of Lesson 1, the number of days of instruction plus assessment time will be given. Each unit will have additional days built in. However, the number of days will vary. Those days can be used for assessment, remediation, or enrichment. When it is the first lesson of a new unit, you will also see a unit note. A unit note is going to highlight the main objectives of that unit. So what it is that students should be able to do as they progress through the unit. Here you will see the list of Alabama Course of Study Mathematics standards that are specifically addressed in this lesson. Sometimes you will encounter a lesson where parts of the standard are struck through. If that's the case, that just means that that particular part of the standard is not being addressed in that lesson. However, it will be addressed somewhere else. Like the unit note, the teacher note is specific to this lesson. So the unit note is giving the big ideas of the overall unit. The teacher note is giving the big ideas of that particular lesson. So here, students need to have a strong understanding of what a function is. This kind of summarizes your presentation strategies and takes the big ideas from there and gives you an overview of what it is that students should be able to do by the conclusion of this lesson. Each lesson will feature prerequisites. This helps you to know what students need to be able to do in order to be successful with this lesson. So what should students be able to do prior to starting this lesson? Here are the materials needed. All applicable pages that students will need printed have been downloaded for you and are in a student pages file that follows each individual lesson. If you're looking for remediation or enrichment ideas, you can check out the additional support slash resources. The presentation strategies are like your lesson plan. So it will share with you um, ways to group your students. So is this lesson going to be best in students working individually? Do they need to be with a partner? Do they need to be with a group of four? You will also see um, active engagement strategies. So if it's a, a group activity, what is each student's role? Will they jigsaw the activity? Will they, you know, turn and talk to their partner? So all of the different ways to actively engage your students in the lesson will be included here in your presentation strategies. And so instead of trying to figure out what it is that you have to do on each day, a detailed version of each day is given for you. So there you have the scope and sequence.